Hello and welcome back. In this lesson, we're going to be talking about preparing for your VCAP DCD certification exam. We'll first start out by taking a look at the VCAP DCD certification and where it fits in the overall VMware certification path. Next, we'll look at the VCAP DCD exam itself, and then we'll talk about preparing for the exam and taking the exam. Are you ready? Let's jump right in. VCAP stands for VMware Certified Advanced Professional, and the VCAP DCD and VCAP DCA certifications are follow-up certifications from VMware's entry-level VMware Certified Professional, or VCP. Now, the VCAP DCA, or Data Center Administration, is targeted at professionals who are primarily going to be responsible for managing and administering vSphere environments, hence the name Data Center Administration. VCAP DCD, on the other hand, is targeted for professionals who are tasked with designing vSphere environments, hence the title Data Center Design. Both VCAP DCD and VCAP DCA, although they are independent of one another, are prerequisites if you wish to proceed on to VCDX, or VMware Certified Design Expert. This course is aimed towards helping you prepare for the VCAP DCD exam, to be prepared for taking the Data Center Design exam. Now the Data Center Design exam itself is targeted at IT architects and consulting architects capable of designing VMware solutions in a multi-site large enterprise environment. That phrase was taken from VMware's VCAP DCD program overview found on VMware's website at the URL currently shown on your screen. The exam itself is a four hour exam with over a hundred questions. The questions can be both multiple choice as well as Visio style questions. The multiple choice questions may ask you to select the best answer, they may ask you to select the right answer, or they may ask you to select all correct answers. The Visio style questions offer a drag and drop canvas where you're asked to build a solution using components and based on the scenario and information provided to you. It's a challenging exam. So how do we prepare for this exam? Well, there's a variety of resources that are available to help you prepare. There is, of course, this video training series, which we hope will do a great job of getting you ready. There's also the book titled VMware vSphere Design, written by Forbes Guthrie, yours truly, Scott Lowe, and Mesh Seidel Kiesing, where we go into a great level of detail on VMware vSphere Design, the process, the thoughts that go into creating a design, and the considerations. I would also recommend that you have a close look at the VCAP 4 DCD and VCAP 5 DCD exam blueprints that are both available from VMware. Those will give you a very specific idea of the topics that are covered, the skills that are tested, as well as provide additional resources, both VMware and non-VMware resources, that will help you prepare for the concepts and knowledge tested by the exam. In addition, there are numerous study guides available on the internet, too many to mention, and if I even started listing them, I guarantee I would omit a very good one. So I encourage you to seek out VCAP DCD study guides and VCAP DCD experiences that others have published to make available to those who haven't yet taken the exam. When it comes time to take the exam, I recommend you get a good night's sleep the night before. This is not an exam where you can cram at the last minute to get the information you need. This exam is a very intellectual exam. It requires you to already have a deep knowledge of the topics that are involved and be able to work through the questions to come to the answer. Some exams are, well, let's face it, rote memorization and a last minute cram can help. I don't think that's really gonna do you a whole lot of good here. So be sure and get a good night's sleep the night before. Arrive at your testing center early and be sure and bring your photo ID and all the necessary paperwork. Double check with Pearson View, who is the testing provider for VCAP DCD to make sure that you have the right paperwork that changes based on their requirements. As you're taking the exam, plan your time carefully because there are over a hundred questions and because the questions are scenario based. You can run out of time if you're not watching that. As you read the questions, be sure to take the time to reread the questions and make sure you understand both the information that's being provided and the answer that they are seeking. These are primarily scenario based questions. So you will have to make sure that you are breaking down the information that's being provided and getting a good feel for what the answer is that they're asking you about or what it is that they're asking you to build on one of these Visio style drag and drop questions. In this lesson, we first took a look at the VCAP DCD certification itself and then looked at the VCAP DCD exam. Then we talked about how to prepare for the exam and when it comes time to take the exam, some helpful tips. Best of luck with your exam. 